What's up guys, my name is Bryce and welcome back to some more Granny. Today I'm going to be showing you some awesome glitches that I found, so let's just hop right in and get started. Okay, so this first trick I'm going to show you is a super easy one to pull off and it actually makes it super easy to beat the game at absolutely any difficulty with no trouble from Granny. It's a pretty simple one, so let me show you how you do it. So you can do it right off after the first day, all you have to do Pick this vase up, toss it by the bed, and then wait for Granny to come and visit. Then what you have to do is get over into this corner. I usually tend to move just a little bit away from the actual corner. And then you just have to wait for Granny to come into the room. Once she gets here, you have to crouch and then start spamming this button as fast as you can. Go, 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 go. And if you do it right, then Granny will actually get stuck standing there and you can go do whatever you want. You can get super close to Granny, give her a nice big kiss, mwah, because she is looking absolutely beautiful today. So now you can just go through the entire house, do whatever you have to do and escape with zero trouble from Granny because she's going to stay in here as long as you play because she's going nowhere. The only way to reset her is if you accidentally die somehow, you like, you know, falling through the roof or something. So don't do anything stupid like that and then you can win however you want to because now Granny is just sort of sitting here showing you how beautiful she is. Actually, you know what guys? I think we need to troll Granny a little bit. We can't just leave her here standing here all alone without doing a little bit of trolling first. So let's go grab her favorite teddy bear. I think that might be fun. I'm curious if maybe we can get her out of that if we like put the teddy bear right in her face and see how mad she gets. Oh, Granny's gonna be real pissed. All right, let's get the teddy bear super quickly. We'll just go right on in here, open it up, and boom! Here we are, Mr. Teddy. Let's go see what Granny's up to. I'm sure she's very upset that we have this, and she's gonna come running, right? Oh, Granny! Granny, don't you want the teddy bear? Don't you care about it anymore? Oh no, Granny, what's wrong? Your eyes are so beautiful. Look at those. They're so red and evil looking. What? Do, do you want the teddy bear? Do you, do you want the teddy bear, Granny? You just gotta take a few steps and grab it. Come on. Come on, you know you want it. No, oh, it's, it's right by your face. All you gotta do is grab it. <laughs> it kinda looks like she's actually eating the teddy bear. Be like, hum, num, 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 num. No! Granny, you don't eat teddy bear. What are you doing? You cuddle teddy bears. You, you don't actually eat them. <laughs> oh my gosh. She is looking absolutely terrifying right now. I'm a little bit curious though. Can I shoot her with the crossbow though? Will that keep her stuck or will that release her? Let's actually go test that out. I'm a little bit curious because that's the only thing I don't know. We just got to find the weapons key and then we can test that. You still having fun over here, Granny? Oh, look at her. She's so cute. She's just a really good power walker. Oh, and what happened to her arm? Oh my goodness. It's, it's like right out of her socket. Oh no. Granny, I think we need to get you to a doctor. That, that does not look good. <laughs> All right. So let me go uh, get the crossbow super quickly and then we'll see if we can't... Uh, can't tease Granny a little bit with that. So let's just grab the crossbow, boom, and boom. And then we can get Granny down from there. As I said, this glitch does work on any difficulty. So if you want to do it on extreme, easy, whatever, uh, go for it. I did it on easy because I just didn't feel like having her chase me too fast. But yeah, it works on any difficulty, but it may take a few tries to do. Like, just keep trying it. Sometimes I have a little bit of trouble with it. So just keep trying. I promise it does work in the 1.3 version. So uh, in the meantime, I kind of want to shoot her and see what happens. Boom. Oh, wait a second. She doesn't even care about the darts now. <laughs> Granny's invincible. No. Oh, no. I, I shot her with the dart, but she just did not care. Let's try shooting her right in the face. I'll put it right in her mouth. Go. <laughs> Granny just spit the dart right out. She's like, Puh. I'm not taking your puny trank darts anymore. She is pissed. She's like, oh, you might be able to freeze me, but there is no way. No way you're actually going to get me down. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Granny, put your hands up. Put your hands up. I will get you down with one of these darts. It's gonna happen. What? Where did that? 
You are magic. She is absolutely magic at this point. Holy crap. Well, I guess that settles it. The only way to actually get her out of this glitch is to either reset the game or to die from falling through the ceiling. So as long as you don't do either of those two things, you have Granny permanently stuck. So you control her, you can learn the map a little bit better, or you could just get a super easy win on extreme difficulty and brag to all your friends about how you beat it in two minutes or whatever. But that is a pretty cool glitch. But I've actually still got a couple more glitches to show you so granny you don't go anywhere just stay put for me ah uh, <laughs> and we'll get into the next one so for this next glitch once again you can do it on any difficulty and this one is just a little bit less op than the last one so if you want to play the actual game and just sort of have a little bit of a boost rather than just being able to beat it no matter what uh this is probably a better glitch for you so all you have to do is head on outside to this area super easy to get to and then what you have to do is turn your back to this and then start going backwards and right just a little bit while going in and out of this and if you do it just right it'll actually keep you going in and out of it even though you go past the radius of it so let me let me try just a little bit to see if i can get it to actually work again these glitches take a few tries so if they don't work on the very first one just keep going for a little bit because i promise they do all work i'm not editing anything to make them look a little bit better this is legitimately just how the game works so you just have to keep trying until you eventually get it to work because i promise all of them do work. Oh, hi, Granny. <laughs> One second. I'll be right back. Okay, she's gone now. Let's try it again. Come on. Nice and slow. Nice and slow. Come on. Here we go. We just got to keep swapping back and forth as fast as we can. Oh, oh, there we go. There we go. I definitely got it. Okay, nice. So now we can, uh, now you can see I'm clearly not in the box. I'm not anywhere near the box, but it's still giving me the option to go back inside. And then it'll teleport me back right to where I was. So with our newfound powers, we can actually do some major trolls on Granny. So now I'm in the basement because I like this area a lot. So I'm just gonna knock this thing over right here. Boom. And now we just have to wait for Granny to come because eventually she's gonna know that there was a noise down here and she's gonna come visit, right? Oh, this is gonna be good. As you guys know, there's no spot to hide in the basement. She's gonna see me. I'm gonna die. No! Nope. Except... Now I'm in the other place. I'm actually outside and she can't kill me even though she was right next to me. So as long as I hit the button, I can actually save my life no matter where I am. So it gives me such a huge advantage, but it doesn't make it completely OP because if she sneaks up behind you, she can actually still kill you. So you gotta be careful because you never really know where she's gonna be. And then you have to also be careful because the second you go back, she might be in your face, so you're risking it when you go visit. So let's see if she's right in my face or not. Okay, good, she's gone. That would have been really bad if she was still here. Okay, uh, where are you at, Granny? You upstairs now? Let's, uh, let's ring the bell. Let's ring the bell. Oh, oh, I actually gotta ring it. There we go. There we go. Let's ring the bell, and we're gonna see where Granny is. Where are you? As long as we stay somewhere that we can always see her, there's no way she can get us. She's gonna see me over here. Hey, Granny, how you doing? And, oh, you, you, you don't see me. There you nope. go, now you see me, and I'm gone. <laughs> it's such a cool little trick, cause she's just like, wait, what? <laughs> oh, that's amazing. I didn't realize it was gonna work so well. Oh, that's great. Let me go back again, see where she's at. Where'd you go, Granny? Oh, there you are. Did you, did you lose me that fast? Are you really that bad at finding me? She's like, I don't like this game anymore. I don't like this. Nope. No, Granny. No, 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 no. There's no killing me. <laughs> oh, I wonder. Oh, can I do it with the teddy bear? Ooh, that could be cool. That could be really cool, actually. Okay, I gotta wait a second for her to move. You always gotta make sure you wait. You can't just jump out right after you do it or you'll jump right back into her face and die. And, you know, I'm not a big fan of dying, so I'd like to avoid that. All right, so let's just get up here really quickly and go visit my favorite teddy bear. I love that guy. Teddy's such a cool bro. But as you guys know, when you grab teddy bear, she will see you no matter where you are on the map. So she'll come visit you. I'm a little bit curious what'll happen if I do that while using this glitch. I'm gonna stay in here for now just to test it out because I don't know if I'm gonna be safe or not. And I don't want to lose the glitch quite yet because it is a little bit difficult to get. So you got to do quite a few tries before you get it. But luckily for me, it didn't take very long. So let's just wait here, play with my little Teddy because I love him so much. And then Granny will be here in no time. Come on, girly. I know we're on easy and you're really slow right now, but come on. 
Okay, so she's on the other side of this. So let's teleport over here and see if now the heartbeat is still in this container or not. So basically we're seeing if the heartbeat goes to the hiding spot or if it stays where the player technically is. So let's go back and see what happened. Is Granny still here? Granny? You, you still, oh yes she is. Okay, so she always stays with you no matter what when you grab the teddy bear. So you can hide from her, but she's not going anywhere. Trust me on that one. So don't use this glitch to try and put it up in the crib. It's not gonna work. She's just gonna stand right on your corpse and probably brutally murder you. No, no, I don't. <laughs> and probably brutally murder you as soon as you get back. So you gotta be a little bit smart with your trolls. You can't be completely stupid. I've actually got one more idea with this actually. Oh, oh, that could be cool. I want to go up to the attic and see if I can save myself from dying by fall damage. Like, is the fall damage because I fall through the thing or is it because I fall a certain amount? And will teleporting between the box actually stop that for me? I'm really curious now. So let's head on that way and uh, see if we can't figure it out. Oh, shoot. Oh, does it work with bear traps though? Oh, I want to test that. Oh, no, it doesn't. No, it doesn't. You can't hide while you're in a bear trap. Ah! Oh, no. <laughs> Well, now we know you guys probably didn't expect that, but no, you can't hide while you're in a bear trap. That was a stupid idea. <laughs> oh, here we go. I got the glitch working again and just in time. Granny's gonna actually come visit me. Hey, girly. How you doing? Did you miss me? Did you miss me, Granny? Oh, come on, girl. Nope. Come on. Oh, oh, she knows I'm in the... Oh, nope. that's interesting. I did not realize that was something. Nope. So now I just have to sort of hop between. Nope. That's kind of sketchy. I don't like that. <laughs> okay. So I gotta be nope. a little bit careful here because Granny actually still knows that I'm hiding in here. Nope. Oh, well, that's not good. You don't see me. I'm invisible. Nope. <laughs> Are you kidding me? <laughs> oh, come on, Granny. You're better than that. Wait, did I just get her stuck? No, I didn't get her stuck. I was really hoping. Oh, that would have been amazing if I could have glitched the glitch. Oh, that would have been so good. Okay, so now we just got to get... Oh, I forgot I was back here. Granny! Granny, I, I need to get... Oh, my goodness. I need to get in there. Oh, gosh. All right, let's pull her back out real quick. Come on. Okay. Don't mind me, Granny. Don't mind me. Just going to jump around you and go on upstairs. Because I wanted to check out if I could save myself from dying in the attic. Also, I mean, I guess while I'm here, I might as well show you another really cool glitch on how you can actually get into the attic without using a hammer. It's really freaking awesome. So all you have to do is grab a vase, any vase will work, and then you just walk up to these boards over here. You get super close with the vase and then drop. Boom, it goes in there. Uh, I'm gonna hide. Oh, oh, you can hide in a different one while hiding. Oh, that's interesting. So I can hide in a different box but will it break the glitch? Oh, I wonder. I actually don't know if it'll break it or not. But yeah, by throwing the vase into that other area, Granny will cure it. She'll think that that's somewhere she has to go. And then she'll break the boards down and break it for you. So you don't even need the hammer except for, you know, the actual door. So it's an easy way to get up into the attic without actually having to use the hammer. In the meantime, I'm not actually too worried about that. I wanted to test this. If I jump off of this and then, wait, let me check. Okay, it does still work. So if I, okay, we're going, we're going, we're going, we're going, we're going, we're jumping off. Am I dead? Did I die? I, I'm not dead. I'm, I'm kind of dead. I'm questionably dead. I'm, I'm alive. <laughs> yes. Are you kidding? <laughs> I cheated death. Unfortunately, I can't move my screen anymore, which may be a major problem, but I am definitely still alive. Okay, let's go upstairs, see if Granny's here. Granny! Oh, <laughs> she's like, um, why is there a dead person walking around my house? Hey, hey, don't worry about it, Granny. You look pretty dead too. You're not the one to be passing judgment here. Can I do it again? Uh, if I jump off, will I die again? I don't know. Okay, I'm gonna test it. Will I die? Okay, yep, I died the second time. <laughs> I did not expect to get a glitch within a glitch there. That is pretty freaking awesome. So if you do the little glitch, uh, you keep spamming it really quickly while going down there. You survive. Granny can't see you. 
but you also horribly broke the game and now you can't really do that much. So I don't know. <laughs> I don't know how worth it that actually is, but that's a pretty cool thing to know. Also, just to prove for sure that you can get into the attic without using a hammer, I wanted to show you guys what it looks like. I tend to knock this thing down first just for fun because why not? Let's drop this through here. Boom. And now we just have to wait for Grady. I know it didn't actually happen last time, so you guys might be like, Bryce, I don't know how legit that glitch actually is, but don't you worry, I will get it shown for you. Let's just wait just a second for Granny, and then, when she has it opened up, you guys will know for sure. Oh, hey, Granny, I heard that we could use some construction over here. You gonna remodel for me? Thank you, Granny, that's very useful. I didn't even need a hammer to do that. You are amazing. Like, have you ever thought about going into construction work? I think you're just so good at it, Granny. Let's let's give her a nice big hug, because she, she was just so helpful. I don't think she knows how to hug, guys. <laughs> That's all Granny was always missing. Just a little bit of love. And just like that, now you guys know some of the best glitches in Granny. So if you guys enjoyed and learned a little bit of something today, then make sure you smash that like button. And if you want to see more Granny videos, make sure you subscribe and hit that bell so you don't miss any of my new videos. Also, make sure you share this video with a friend so that they can see these awesome glitches as well because I think Granny's a pretty fun game and the glitches just make it all the better. So. Why not share it with everyone else? If you guys have any suggestions on what glitches I should do next, make sure you let me know in the comments down below. I know there's supposedly an invisibility glitch, so if you guys want to see me do that, make sure you let me know. And if you guys have any ideas on different ones I should do, make sure you let me know those as well. And if you guys want to see me actually play Granny, make sure you check out the description down below, because I have a link to the video where I had my very first experience with Granny. Bear in mind, I was a little bit of a noob in that video, so it's a little bit rough, but let me know what you guys think. Go check it out, and I'll see you all in the next video.